Hi there, I'm Cheke Osa, and welcome to episode 4 uh, of My Little Engineer. You know, I am really, really upset right now. Um, I recorded... Uh, hello, Yojana. I recorded uh, a voiceover for this episode live, like I always do. And when I finished recording, I realized that there was no sound from my mic. And apparently there's some problem with my computer. So I did do everything right, but there still was no sound. So I'm going to have to try and fix that. But I can't really replay this, uh, <laughs> uh, you know. So I'm going to have to do commentary offline. Uh, no, it's not offline. But, uh, you know, not live. I'm doing commentary here after and uh, anyways in episode number three I became an engineer as you might have uh, seen um, and that's uh, awesome and my engineering is up to 29 I flipped it up earlier here and, the, and I'm hoping to get it up and I actually will get it up some you'll see how much by the end of the episode uh, uh, I'm gonna kill some Wendigos here, go into the Grizzled Den, kill 10 Wendigos, uh, talk to 3 dudes, and get 6 supplies. Um, and um, I really enjoy playing a warrior, I have to say. Uh, I, think it's the, I think it's the class I enjoy playing the most. I don't know. Uh, those two uh, skills that you have right there, uh, Victory Rush and Execute, I mean they're just awesome and uh, makes it fun and easy to play Warrior. I, I like you know, of course other classes too like you know, Rogue and Hunter and Paladin and I'm sure I'm forgetting someone I really like too. Uh, but I, I'm wondering if Warrior isn't the one I like the most, it's definitely one I played the most I think. Um, yeah, the engineering, um, hoping to uh, get it high as early as possible, uh, of course you always need the next, you know, ore thing, first here uh, you get copper for a while, and then you're gonna need tin. Um, <laughs> it feels really weird coming in this afterwards, I'm so used to doing it live. And I maybe I should be commenting more about what I'm actually doing, but since I know what's gonna happen, it's making it a little harder. <laughs> um, uh, here in the beginning of the cave, I was wondering where are those three guys I'm supposed to talk to? Can't one guy be out here so I know I'm right? Um, so I mean I know I'm in the right place for that one too, uh, but they weren't. But no worries, I'm sure they will show up. Um, number eight, Windigus. Uh, there's the third supply, and let's kill this Muta. And of course, I thought the commentary, the commentary I did for this video went really great. Uh, of course, I felt that way since since there was no sound recorded. Um. A little anxious getting copper here when I got into the cave. As you might have seen on the minimap, there was a copper or a uh, copper vein up to the right there, and wanted to get to it. And killing some Wendigos. This sword I'm having, um, I looked at it before. Um, it's really awesome uh, for the level that I'm at. I, I found out later here in this episode that you know, even the, for this quest that I'm doing now, I got a worse sword than this one. So uh, I don't know. I got. Uh, of course, I'm very soon gonna have to replace it, but it looks cool and yeah, was <laughs> really good for level three or whatever I got. It might have been level four. Hello, Denston. What's up? You wanna talk to me? Okay, I'll kill this one first. What? You don't help me, Dunstan? Come on! You gotta help me! 
There are two Wendigos on me, and you don't help? He just stands there. He doesn't even look. Like, I don't give a shit. If you're not here to talk to me, then go away. Boom. Kill. Kill. Yay. Alright, let's talk to Dunstan. Uh, I convey the orders. I have no idea what orders. Maybe I should follow in the story a little bit more. <laughs> Here's the second dude, right? Almost next what to him. And he certainly won't help me kill some Wendigos either. And here, uh, as you see, there are two copper beams in there, which was great. Because you need a lot of copper and, uh, of course, rough stone you need uh, for the engineering here in the beginning. Maybe I should just have made some, you know, music uh, to the video instead, instead of me commentating afterwards. Which feels really awkward. Uh, <laughs> Alright. How's the leveling? Halfway to level 8. Of course, I realize that it's gonna take a lot of episodes um, to get to 600 in engineering and level 90. And uh, by that time, I will definitely, you know, it will most likely have been. Uh, what's what's it called? Warlords of Draenor have most certainly have come out by then. So then I have to be level hundred, and I guess level six hundred and seventy-five uh, in engineering. I hope you really can make uh, cool stuff there at six seventy-five. It must be something, you know. And eventually I get there, I guess. And if I post one of these videos of about 20 minutes every week, <laughs> that would take <laughs> like a few years. Uh, but I'm probably, you know, once summer is over and I get more time to play, uh, I'll probably post these videos uh, much more often than once a week. But here, in the first weeks, it will be once a week because summertime, you want to do other stuff. And uh, yeah. Alright. So the last dude is in there. Let's go talk to him. And then I can get out of here. Mr. Vulgrum. They don't have as cool names as the, as the gnomes. I really, not, I really like the gnomes. Uh, you know, names. And some Wendigo, of course, has spawned when you were on your way out. Isn't it always like that? You know, when you want something to spawn, you can wait forever and it never spawns. And uh, then when you don't want something to spawn, it, of course, it will spawn very quickly. And here, look, <laughs> the Wendigo just spawned there. When I don't need them anymore, I just want to get out of this damn game. Yeah. Um, Leveling pretty fast here in this episode because um, I was rested, as I'm sure you have noticed. Um, I uh, I played the first three episodes back to back, and uh, then I didn't play for a pretty long while. And there I look at my sword. Yay! What was it called? I missed it. Very shiny thing. No. <laughs> Very light something, I think, because, you know, it's, it's not a light saber, but it almost looks like one. So it's very light, uh, and it gives off light. Yes, that's so funny. You know, Blizzard humor. It can actually, <laughs> it can actually be pretty good sometimes. Uh, for those of you who have played uh, well for a long time, uh, when you got out of this cave, you had to run all the way around up there to the right. Uh, uh, but nowadays you can take the shortcut to Karanas up left here, of course, um, which, uh, well, they made a lot of things easier to, uh, you know, the, th the thing, the snow here, it really, really messes up my videos. I don't know if you've seen it. Well, I'm sure you have. <laughs> You know, it gets really laggy uh, when all this snow it gets, you see all the pixels and I don't know why, 
I think it's gonna get better once we're out of the tomorrow. Uh, maybe not. Maybe it's just me walking quick and then. And of course, there's an, here I got Wendigo leggings, which were actually a lot better, even though they were just leather. <laughs> See you soon. Uh, yeah. I guess that's how it's like in the beginning. Yeah. And I got no no mail stuff from Mr. Taran here, if I remember correctly. Yes. So here I I was deciding, hmm, will I go for some more questing or will I uh, do some engineering? And I'm like, ah, uh, nah, I'll wait with the engineering until the end of the episode. And I'm going to try and do it like that. At the end of each episode, I'll do the engineering. Uh, so I'll quest, quest. For 20 minutes and then do some engineering and then it's up out uh, of course it won't always work sometimes I have to quest more than 20 minutes so there might be episodes where I don't engineer at all but if I engineer I'm gonna try and do it as much as possible at the end of the video so if it's the engineering you want to see well <laughs> I guess you skip to the end of the videos uh, I might have to do some engineering in the videos too but yeah all right, scavengers. This is a little weird here. These trolls. You're supposed to kill the scavengers to get the the what the hero mechanic gear, but um, you can't kill the scouts to get the gear, and you don't have another quest to kill the scouts, which is kind of rare, I guess. You usually, you know, have to do. Even though some guys like scavengers can drop one thing, but then you usually have a quest. Too, but not here. Nope, not here. And I don't want no pets. Because I'm an engineer and I'm an engineer. You know, you see really how the video lags out when I stand still. And then as soon as I start moving, uh, we get a little bit of a little lag. A little, 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 little lag. And, um, well, I guess there's not, there isn't much I can do about that. I guess it's just my uh, my computer and my graphic cards and stuff that's not good enough. But it's definitely watchable. If it wasn't watchable, I wouldn't post it. So I definitely think it's watchable. And I think this episode is actually better than the last one when it comes to that. I let the computer rest before this one. <laughs> so I can... Here I find two more copper things on the map and I am so excited because we really need some copper here in the beginning to get to the engineer and take care of that too. Hello buddy! You're not funny, you run away. That bunny was not funny. <gasps> and I'm not here right now. Never, ever. Maybe not now anyway. Um <laughs> Alright, I burned the last totem and Got some copper, yay! Boom, boom. All right, so I couldn't get up that way, which I didn't think, I actually said in the video, I probably can't get up this way, and I probably have to run around, and I had to. So I go up here instead, and get the next copper thing. So, what can you do in engineering? I really haven't, uh, you know, <laughs> I really haven't checked that out. I mean, I know you can make helicopters and uh, motor uh, motorcycles, bikes, and uh, stuff. Uh, bikes, motor motorcycles, not 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 bikes, bicycles. <laughs> that would be really really cool though, if you can make a bicycle <laughs> just pedal around. <laughs> Oh, that would be so cool. Alright, uh, two more uh, scavengers to go. And move back a little so the scout can see me. And when I'm done with these two scavengers, I'm gonna head back to Karanos and do uh, some engineering. Alright, one more to go. Where can I find a scavenger? Uh, I'm hoping I'm get. I hope I, I really hope I get this mic issue uh, 
fixed until the next video so you will have live uh, a live recording of the audio from me in episode 5 I must I must get it fixed I won't record until I've gotten it fixed uh, because this uh, really sucked commenting in after after the video and I'm sure it sucks when you're watching it too you want live audio all right so back to Karen Oz and I can't really you know pretend to do live audio you will you would have noticed right away that it wasn't live so um, I I did it this way okay the last 10 minutes of the video and uh, they're mostly gonna be engineering first I got uh, what did I get here right I didn't get a, I did not get a better weapon here I hope I do very soon you should have given me a better weapons Tharn uh, this guy here spry sprocket Rassle spry sprocket I mean talk about a cool name I, I know I said it in the uh, previous episode. I guess it was the last one. Spry Sprocket. Uh, there are more gnomes with cool names. Let's see what I was doing here. Putting on the belt. Right. And here I figured, oh, it's like 10 minutes left of the episode. Um, am I going to go engineer right away? And I'm like, nah, it won't take 10 minutes to engineer, so uh, I went off running to uh, return this quest and get the next one just, you know, to fill out the time. And then it took longer to engineer than I thought, so <laughs> this was uh, highly unnecessary uh, to do this little run here, but I did it and I can't change it. So here we go. And here I return to Mr. Crank Toggle. Look at Delbert Crank Toggle. I think I'm gonna have to change my name to that. Crank Toggle. Uh, but my name is Osan. <clears throat> uh, my name is Osan, of course, so uh, that's pretty cool too. So I guess I don't have to change it. Alright, back to Karen Oz for the engineering stuffing. I found out that that thing there was going to take me to the next questing place. So that's all I went there for. But now, as you see, I have to smelt some copper first, and then I can do the engineering. Yeah. Some uh, blasting powder to get up to 30. 30, uh, I could make some new stuff, new engineering stuff. And uh, first off, let's smelt here at this small little forge they got here in Karanos. A very small one. And let me have a drink. Not an alcohol drink. Yeah. You might think that I am uh, high. Not that I'm drunk <laughs> when I do this commentary. But I'm not. Alright, three more. Come on, come on, million. My little engineer, million. All right, finally off to do some engineering. Make a blasting powder first. Come on, you have to make one to get to 30. All right, I checked it out first, engineering. 30, yes, so make one blasting powder. Boom! And I'm 30 and I can make handful of copper bolts and rough copper bomb. Which I guess is better than the dynamite. And this requires a blacksmith hammer. Which for some reason I did not get when I bought the engineering skill. Which of course I should have but I'm going down there to the anvil anyway so it didn't really matter. Uh, I'm just checking out where the next one is. Level 50. So I don't have to go back to the trainer, the professions trainer, until I'm level 50 in engineering. And down I go. And trying to find uh, someone who sells 
blacksmithing supplies, and here he is, Thrawn Boltar. Boltar, Bulta in Swedish, is definitely something you need in, in blacksmithing and engineering. Uh, so I guess that's where he got his name, no I don't know. Alright, uh, to make bombs I need two blasting powders and not one handful of cover bolts. So I got 12 blasting power, let's make, let's make six copper bars which means I can make six bombs for starters here okay copper bomb six of them yay three four five six and I'm gonna have to use these bombs they do so incredibly much damage 14 fire damage, look at that. <laughs> oh my god. So unuseful. But I think I'm gonna use it just because this is my little engineer, you know. Alright, so here I was thinking what to do now. And I figured I'd do some more bombs to get it up to 50. Actually, let's see. Uh, yeah, right. I think I got it to 48 here doing the blasting powder. Yes. And made two bars. Uh, I mean, two couple bolts to get it to 50. And then I could buy the next thing. And it's really annoying that the professions trainer isn't down there. I understand. I mean, he trains all the professions. So most professions don't want you to be down in the forge. But. No, not not Frostbeard, not Dwarves, we don't like Dwarves, let's talk to him. And now I can make Arc Light Spanner and Rough Boomstick. Uh, I can make a gun. You know, I guess you're supposed to be a hunter when you're an engineer. Because <laughs> uh, you can make scopes and guns and stuff. But it doesn't really matter because uh, you probably get better stuff anyway. Um, not doing the engineering so you know I might as well be a warrior here I want to make the helicopters and the and the motorbikes and stuff so and hopefully even more cool stuff uh, at a, a higher level all right so I wanted to make a rough uh, boom stick there because it levels up four and of course I had to find a wooden stock and I thought maybe 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 um, the tradesman would sell it to me, but he's a dwarf, so he didn't. <laughs> no, but the uh, trade did not have a boom, a uh, wooden stock, and uh, as we'll soon find out, neither does a general salesman. So maybe in the next episode, I'll find a wooden stock, or I'll just skip that and do other stuff. I will do other stuff here soon. All right, can you get moving, please? Don't just stand there and do nothing. All right, so next one is level 60. And, uh, yeah, yeah. And go, yay! Did I go for the wooden stock here? No, I guess I didn't. Thought I did. Alright, I went down here instead. And get it up to 60. And I actually think I got it a little bit higher. Let's see here. First of all, let's make some more uh, handful of cover balls so I can make four bombs. I had eight blasting powder, so that's. That was. Uh, that was uh, the right amount. And here we go. I could only make six uh, more rough stone, so uh, rough blasting powder. I mean, from the rough stone, I only had six rough stones, so I went ahead and made them. Uh, and then the copper balls. You know, uh, in engineering, you make stuff to be able to use to make other stuff, and that's a little bit annoying. I think because uh, I made the last few bombs here. Uh, uh, that's a little bit annoying because um, you don't really know what to do. When you try to do 
to get the engineering up without using material uh, unnecessarily, you know, to be as most efficient as you can be. And uh, that can be kind of tough when you make stuff to make stuff and stuff. Um, but, uh, but that's the way it is, and uh, it's kind of fun in a way because it's a little bit different than the other professions, I think. So, I got it up to 62, and I think I was gonna go down to do some more, and then I changed my mind. I said, nah, I'll just end the video here. And see first if I can find a general um, dude. Uh, let's see here. I thought I think he's down. He's down there to the right. The white dude. No, he wasn't. <laughs> it was that dude, <laughs> the orange spear dude. Uh, and he did not sell a wooden stock either. So I may maybe I'll find one in the next episode. And he wasn't up there either. No, of course that's the treeness for. Um, so, I figured here I'll, I would end the video, and um, thanks so very much for watching, and uh, don't forget to like the video if you did like it, um, and uh, I will see you in the next one, I hope, and, and there you will get live commentary, I'm sure. Uh, so, um, let's see you then, and thanks for watching. Bye-bye!